Yo, whoa, whoa, it's your boy praying and Rose. We are back with another video, man. And today, man, look, y'all, look. Go ahead and put on your scouters, bro. Go ahead and put on your scouters. We got the scans. Now look, man. Now look. Y'all need to watch this full video for me because, y'all, we got so much information, bro. For real, for real. And plus, look, we need a thousand likes, my guy. Look, it's three o'clock in the morning where I'm at. I stayed up for y'all. You feel me? Look, you know I care. I had a couple of sense of beans. Look, I'm, I'm ready. Feel me already. So look, y'all, I don't know what type of sense of beans these non-subscribers be eating, my guy. Look, I fought this non-subscriber yesterday. He was keeping up with me. You feel me? Hey, bro, don't try me. You know I dropped them off. Don't play with me like that. You know I dropped them off. After I dropped them off, me and him became cool. Hey, bro, hey, hit the notification bell. That's my guy right there. Look, he's an elite warrior now. Now, look, all you non-subscribers, bro, if you want to become an elite warrior today, all you got to do is quit acting like a low-class warrior, my guy. That is not cool. You feel me? Move your hand from the dislike button and move it to the like button, bruh. Make sure you like and comment on the video. Make sure you hit that thumbs up button for me, bruh. A thousand likes and make sure you subscribe to the channel. Now, look, if you don't want to do that, my guy, look, I've been charging up this comment. I'm at hot. I need somebody to aim it at. I'm always aiming at you. You feel me? I don't want to do you like that. But again, thank y'all so much for the support. I ain't going to keep y'all for too long because, look, I know y'all got to get the training. You feel me? I know y'all getting ready for DLC 3, man. So, look, y'all, I ain't going to keep y'all for too long. Let's go ahead and get to this video. Now look, bro. Now look. I know y'all tired of hearing me say this, but it's my last time. Now look, y'all. We'll be going live tonight at 12 o'clock streaming the new DLC for Xenoverse 2. Make sure y'all come by. Even if you don't like Xenoverse, you still can come through and support your boy, and I appreciate it. Turn on your notification bells. But look, enough of that. Let's go ahead and get to the good stuff. So look, y'all. For all the people that saw my recent video, I said Kakarot will be in this V-Jump scan. I told y'all be talking to Baba. You feel me? Me and her cool. You feel me? I told y'all that. I said it will be in this because Xenoverse already got their stuff out the way and fighters. Now look, let's go ahead and look at the scans because y'all, I'm so hyped for this because I, bro, I, I got so much to say. I got so much to say. So look, first of all, the scan looks good. You feel me? Everything look cool and everything. You got the Androids. We got some extra screenshots. We got all this crazy stuff. Now, let's go ahead and zoom in a little bit. Now, shout out to my boy RC Burrito because he's the one that translated this stuff to me. Now, as y'all can see, you see Android 17, 18 throwing out this huge blast. Now, one of the texts did say that Android 18 and 17 got this little collab blast, something like that. Look, that's cool and all, but if I can't use it, I do not care. I'm just being honest. Now, I want y'all to look at this picture right here. Now, look, you see Gohan using this little evasive move that he had in Xenoverse. Forgot the name of it, but look. I need y'all to look at the background of that. Now, there are two important things in this picture. The first thing first is look where they're fighting at, my guy. In the city, which I did make a video on saying that it's going to be a huge possibility that we are going to be able to fight in the city. Y'all remember that video I made? I told y'all that. You feel me? We about to go crazy because everybody know in the base game, you cannot fight in the city. So look, Bandai, clap it up for you, my guy. And the next important thing in this screenshot. Now look at who Gohan is fighting. I don't know if that's 17 or 18. Of course, it's one of the androids, but look at his aura. He's a villainous enemy. I told y'all that Toa and Mira was going to come back and make a return and make them evil. You feel me? Toa and Mira is the only one that has villainous enemy powers that could turn people evil. So y'all remember when I said that in my video, bro, when I told y'all the storyline is going to change. It just doesn't make sense. And look, I'm going to show you how. Now, my boy Goresh, he said... Team Trunks and Future Gohan will be playable characters in DLC 3. That's why I told y'all the storyline is going to change. If they kill Future Gohan, he will not become a playable character. I'm telling, bro, oh my God, I told y'all I'll be talking to Baba. I told y'all, you feel me? It just doesn't make sense. You can't kill him and then try to make him a playable character. But you gonna let us play with him for a little bit and take him away? It just doesn't make sense. So yeah, this is confirmation that Team Gohan and Future Gohan will be playable characters. You feel me? Now, we need to go back to this V-Jump scan. So look, y'all, this is very important. I need everybody to hear this. Now, again, shout out to my boy, RC. I told y'all he got the legendary scouter. He be translating everything for me. I appreciate you, my guy. Now, this box says right here. Now, if you translate this, it says this right here. Now, it says details will be released in next issue. That means Kakarot is going to be in the next V-Jump scan for the next month. Look, look, I'm happy. You feel me? That's already confirmation. So that is good for us. Now, there was a second half to the V-Jump 
jump scan that we need to talk about. Now we got the hero size. Now the first half was for the villains, was for the androids. Now we got the hero. Now this is the Trunks and Gohan V jump scan. Now look, this is stuff that we already saw. Now we got this screenshot right here. If we zoom in, it shows um, Trunks like looking at something. I don't know. He's just looking in like the city ruins or something like that. It ain't nothing too crazy, but look, they in the city. That's all good for me. Now the other pictures down below, one of them is a screenshot that we already had when, the, um, when Trunks is looking down at the ground. That one right there. Now we do got two new screenshots. We got Trunks doing Masenko and him doing this little kick thing. Now look, it looked pretty cool, but I don't know what's moving with that now i know everybody's looking at gohan and as you can see he is missing a arm my guy yes gohan is missing an arm so yes we might see his not might we gonna see his arm get blowed off now this is the crazy thing you feel me now i don't know if they gonna give us two variations of him so we could use him with the arm or without the arm but i don't know how serious they gonna take it for playable characters and stuff like that but i would like to see how far they gonna go with it and plus i would like to see the combos with one arm and i want to see his move animations with the one arm so yes i'm happy to see this i'm happy be that we're gonna get one arm gohan because you know games they you know they be a little crazy with the one arm stuff xenoverse he had his arm down but you feel me but i can't wait y'all we getting crazy we getting crazy so look y'all we're gonna have a quick look at the data files real quick and see what bandai been up to now like i said they've been going crazy with 1.60 man they've been working on it working on it working on it now it's like a hundred percent chance that 1.60 is dlc3 now like i said because y'all remember bandai they be loving to say that coming out early june or early i said june i'm all guys i'm tired early summer and stuff like that now if you look up on google it says early summer you see it says june now i already talked about this stuff but i'm gonna re-talk about it just a little bit do a quick rundown just in case you missed that video now like i said you know band i be saying early summer and stuff like that i just put it up for y'all and it says early summer is june now how everything is going to plan like i said in my recent video and we're gonna get a hero side and we're gonna get a villain side we go ahead and check that off because that's exactly what we got we got them both in the v jump scan now bandai already said that in the next v jump scan we are going to get kakra now i don't know what that v jump scan gonna have i'm excited because we already got our villain side that was the android 18 and 17 and we got our hero side and that was the future trunks i said future trunks the kid trunks and future gohan you feel me so i do not know what the next v jump scan is going to be i don't know who they gonna show i don't know what it can be i'm excited for that but like i said for the release date of dlc3 i do feel like we could be seeing it like june the 17th june the 19th or something like that that is my opinion that is what i think that we can be seeing it if everything goes to plan because we supposed to get one more v jump scan for it and after that they're gonna tease another trailer or tease a release date and that's where we're gonna go crazy you feel me so make sure i get ready make sure i get hyped turn on your notification bells but that is all we got for today for the scans man so thank y'all so much for helping me out like i said a thousand likes on this video make sure you like comment and subscribe and tell me your ideas down below and i'm out man i'm out